Friends, welcome you all to Unstoppable Digital Travelling Oxygen for Life. Today we are standing almost at the end of 2022 and I am going to take you back to 2017. Friends, come travel back with us down our memory lane where I am going to share with you the experiences that we have had while visiting Europe in 2017. So yes friends, that was the time when you know Corona has not visited the world and we could uh, visit any places so freely, we did not have to think so much and that's why international traveling was an easy thing for us to do at that point of time. Although not from the money point of view, anybody traveling from India to Europe definitely it takes away a lot of money from you but then we wanted to save some money for this and had a tour with family in Europe. So I also wanted to visit this place before I have a baby because I knew after you have a baby it would be so easy for us to travel for a couple of years out of India. So that was the time you know we really had to uh, plan for this and only after that Jewel was born in the year 2018. So I wanted to visit Europe. One of the strong reasons was because I knew my mother, my father they also wanted to visit Europe. And uh, as they are also getting older, it becomes difficult for them to go separately. So I wanted to visit at that point of time. Although my plan was to send them only to Europe, but then they didn't want to go without us. So we also had to plan with them. And thankfully, see, we planned because now I don't think it will be so easy for us to go to Europe immediately. What happens, happens for the good only friends. What do you think? Okay, so because it was first time we were traveling out of India and were going with family, we thought of taking a travel agent's help and we went via Thomas Cook, which is a well-known travel agent in the world, friends, by the way. And it was a nice tour with them, friends. We got a fantastic tour guide, Mr. Raji, who had been kind enough, patient enough to take us through all the places, explained all the details that we had to know, informed us about the country, its culture, its uh, the way it functions, how we should be uh, going there, what are the uh, places that is most important and interesting one, everything we came to know from Mr. Rajiv and uh, in, in the channel Unstoppable Digital Travelling Friends, if you would like to know about our such experiences with Mr. Rajiv, you can check out my Travelling Treasure uh, episode 2 where I have taken an interview of Mr. Rajiv. So I'll give you the link in the description, you can check out that episode as well so when we have started from Bangalore we have got Lufthansa flight and uh, via Frankfurt we have reached to Paris yes so Paris was our first entry point in Europe friends and then we visited four countries in eight days uh, not could not give so much of time to each of these countries probably in future if possible we'll be able to do that but this time we have seen the cream of Europe what are the main traveling points which I, we had to cover we have visited all those places in these eight days so we visited paris belgium germany and of course switzerland in our upcoming episodes of europe series you are going to see all of this the only regret i had is that at that point of time i did not have a plan that i will be opening up a channel on traveling itself so I don't have that much of videos but how much ever videos I had I'm going to share with all of you through that you can uh, experience our traveling at that point of time. Friends, we have checked in this 
comfortable ibis hotel while uh, reaching in paris so on the first day most of the flights that's coming from india usually reaches in the afternoon or evening time in europe friends so on arrival paris airport we were greeted by thomas cook agent and they have taken us to hotel uh, where after you know freshening up we have visited the um, nearest mall uh, from the hotel which is aeroville from there which uh, one can check out uh, if you are staying in ibis hotel in paris friends it's very close to the airport and after that we were taken to indian restaurant for dinner so that was a um, you know something uh, every would you also like because people from india on the very first day if you get indian food outside uh, the country i'm sure that many of you will also agree we will like it also um i if you ask me i would say that i prefer checking out local cuisine more than uh, you know the country's food because country's food any time we can check out we can eat but when we visit a place it's also nice to see the culture the food um, the taste and the people of uh, the local country explore as much as possible see as much as you can learn from there next day after continental breakfast and a good night sleep also we headed for paris city tour with an english speaking local guide friends after the city tour we had a chance to visit fun filled disneyland in paris and in the evening and night time after dark we get to explore the magical sightseeing of eiffel tower which looks absolutely stunning friends in the night time when the tower is illuminated with lights Friends, look at the time in the clock now. 10:31 in the night time, and if you see, look at Paris. It is just in the evening time. How we see in India, isn't it, friends? So it was also something very new for all of us. We did not had this type of expectation that it will still be so much lighted at night. 10:30, just the sun was setting, and we were moving to see Eiffel Tower at night, friends. Look at the beautiful. beautiful eiffel tower our bus is just reaching near the tower here and we will be getting down from there to witness such beautiful sight as we are seeing right now Eiffel Tower view was captured in the night from Seine River in Paris, France. Later that night, we also had a chance to experience the glamour of the famous Lido show in Paris, which was an unforgettable experience uh, in our tour, friends. Next day in the morning, friends, after breakfast again, we proceeded towards visiting Eiffel Tower. We reached up to second level in the tower, friends, where we have gone through the lift in the Eiffel Tower and seen the beauty. We have seen the view from the top. So during our Paris city tour, friends, we have visited Alexander Bridge, Arc de Triomphe, Concorde Square, Opera House, In Valais, Champs Elysees, and much more in this bus which you are seeing right now, friends. Look at the city, look at the buildings, look at the river. We could capture the crews that they park. You know, there are many uh, rich people, in fact, in Paris who will be buying crews and would be parking in the Seine River. That's a nice. 
serious business for them so we were uh, you know introduced to all of this while visiting paris and exploring the city in our euro tour now we are in disneyland look at us friends i feel if jewel was there she would have enjoyed so much inside this paris disneyland so many options fun rides not only it is a lovely place for the children kids but also adults i'm sure will enjoy this much of entertainment if we see in one place so let me know friends how did you like this episode of our paris tour and in the next trip next day we had to move towards brussels so in our upcoming episode you will be seeing belgium through our eyes friends i am going to share every bit of the videos that i could collect from our euro tour and share with all of you in the year 2022 If you like the video please give like and comment your feelings On Tarifa Okay O N T A R I F A Also if you have not subscribed the channel you need to subscribe to be part of our journey every week one new place new destination i present all of you i mayuri welcome you all to join the family of unstoppable digital traveling oxygen for life